Welcome Stats Busters to question 16. A book has 276 pages and Amina has read a third of the book. How many pages are left for Amina to read? Now as soon as you see any sort of question that talks about a total and a fraction of that total, like a third, you might as well start thinking about using a bar model. Now let's think about this. A bar model. So the whole bar represents the whole book. So the whole book has got 276 pages, okay? Now we're splitting it into thirds. So we've got, we've read one third. So we've read one third, which means we must have two thirds left. So we've got two thirds left to read, okay? So let's just color code this. So the yellow is one third, which we've read. And the green is two thirds, which we've got left to read. So if we work out what one third of 276 is, we can then double it and get the two thirds. So one third, one third of 276 basically means 276 divided by three. We're splitting the whole 276 into three equal sections. So let us do a bush shelter. So how many threes go into 276? Threes into two won't go, but you haven't used the two, so carry. Threes into 27 is nine, and threes into six is twice. So that one third of the book that she's read must be 92. But the other thirds are 92 as well. But we've got two thirds left to read. So that two thirds left to read is two lots of 92. So the two thirds that is left is basically two lots of 92 so let's work that out two twos are four two nines are 18 and because there's no other digits to multiply this one can just go straight in so the final answer if she's read one third she's 92 she's got two thirds left to read so that's 184 as a final check we could just check that 92 plus 184 does actually add up to the 276 pages other than the book. 2 plus 4 is 6, 9 plus 8 is 17, 1 plus 1 is 2. So correct, it does add up to 276, which means 184 is correct.